Women's History Month is a great opportunity for all of us not only to honor women of history, but also to think about, all, for all of us, for me personally, to think about the women in our lives who have shaped who we are, who have made our personal history. Um, as I thought about this, who to choose? My mom, my grandmother, I'm surrounded by incredible women here at PDC. Um, but maybe I'd take a moment to talk not only about some of the big impacts, but there's a woman of, in a smaller way who made a big impact, and that's my friend, Tammy Tyler Cabezas. When she asked you how, how we were, she really meant it. She cared, and she took the time to listen to your answer. We were coordinating on a project together, the old 6360 Northeast Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard project, and um, I had to, I was doing demolition, working with the construction services folks, and we went out one day and um, taking pictures, I, I was con I convinced her, you have to go see a demolition, there's nothing like the dust and the noise and the smell of progress, you have to see this, and the contractor was out there tossing it down. We were giggling, taking pictures, and he stopped and said, um, what are you doing, what are you doing? We told him who we were, and we talked him into letting us get into that tractor, and <laughs> we got great pictures, um, and it was the best time of our lives. A few months after that, she went to the doctor because she was getting some headaches, and um, she found out that she had a brain tumor and that it was inoperable. She was very very brave. I'll never forget that. Um, six weeks later, Tammy passed away. What, what Tammy taught me, and I think a lot of people here at PDC, was life is short. Live joyfully, care deeply, and, and never forget that who you are is not about the title that you have in your, at your work but it's about what you feel and how you live in your heart. That's what you want.